Hey everybody, welcome back to Dead Man DZ's Kanji Study Sessions. We got one more day. This is the last day. This is the last day I'll be doing any of the JLPT words, or at least any of the ones in the official JLPT list. Um, as always, if we see a new kanji in any of the words today, we're going to write them down ten times, go over their readings, their meanings, and how to remember them based on the, the radicals that make up the kanji. If we see a new word like these two today that are made of kanji we already know, we're just going to go over the meanings of the two kanji and how they come together to make our new word. If uh, you don't want to listen to me write them down ten times each, head on over to um, skip skip ahead. So I don't think you'll need to because it's only two words today. And if you just want these word lists, head on over to Google Drive. Our first word of today is kessan. Ketsu on the left side for a decision or a determination. And san on the right side for a calculation. So this is a determining calculation or a determined calculation, a.k.a. the settlement of accounts, the final settling or determination of accounts, closing accounts, or the financial results of something with kessan are the financial results or the final settlement of some accounts. Kesan is a settlement of accounts or the financial results of something. Kesan this. Kesan. The final determination from a calculation. Kesson The final determination of some calculations, a financial result or a closing of accounts. And finally, number two is a kite. Ki on the left side for a law system or regulation, and te on the right side for setting, um, establishing, fixing, or deciding. So kite is a rule that is decided on or is fixed and settled. A regulation or a rule is the primary way I'm going to try and remember this, though it can also mean a prescription or a provision or a stipulation, which a stipulation is just a rule that applies to a certain situation. A kite is a regulation or a rule. It can also mean a prescription or a provision. Kite this. Kite. Kite this. Kite. Kite. a determined or settled law, aka a regulation or a rule, it can also mean a prescription. And what is a prescription if not the rules by which, the settled rules by which you get medicine? Kite to kessan. I'm not going to go over these again because there's only two of them and I kind of am going to remember them no matter what I do here. That's why they're going on flashcards and why in those flashcards, I put them in sentences. Um, that's it for my studies. That, that we've got all the words for the N1. Um, and by that, I mean we don't have all the words for the N1, but we had all the ones on my list um, in my app. So it's been fun. We're going to be back here probably with, with kind of the extra credit slash extra verbs and words that... Um, I see that are interesting. Probably not going to do all the words I learned from here on out, but we're at least going to do the ones that are interesting. I just kind of wanted a record of all the ones that are at least in the JLPT tests. Um, but thanks for watching. If um, you have any questions or just want to say hi, that's cool. Thanks for watching, everyone. Domo, arigatou gozaimashita. Ja, mata tabun. Eto. 12月で12月に再会いましょう。じゃあね。